Did you know that the first letter of the alphabet has three possible pronunciations? So when we're saying the alphabet, we can say A. If we're, if we're introducing this sound to a young child, we'll talk about A. Often in books, you'll see A for apple. If we're using it in a sentence and it's unstressed, it'll be A. If we're using it stressed, we'll go back to the first pronunciation of A. Let's look at a couple of examples. So, I found a cat. Here I'm using the schwa sound because the stress is on found and cat, not on the uh, in the middle. However, if we're looking for my cat, for example, and I could say, I found a cat. So here I'm stressing the A, and this would imply that it's not the cat that I was looking for, but another cat. So, a uh, for unstressed article, A for stressed article, and A uh, when you're teaching young children about the sounds A uh, for apple. Hope that helps. See you soon. Bye.